Okay, so I did forget to tell you one thing, and um, that was how to download the story so that it's editable. So it says click here to download the story, The Bigger Pond. So you're going to click there. And then after you click there, it's going to bring this down here, which is going to be the PDF version. And when you click it, it's still kind of opening it in like um, Google. So what you have to do is like if I move it away, it's going to move away. You have to click here. It's that arrow and it says download. And then you have to choose where you're going to download. I would download it to my desktop and then, of course, to my ELA. You should have this already. And of course, mine is grade three. It's completely different than yours. Um, so let me just go back. I'm just going to download it to my desktop and then I would give it its name, a bigger pond, and then I would write my last name there. And then I would hit save. Once I do that, it will do that again. This time, um, I apologize. Uh, it's going to do that again, but don't open it. You're going to go here to your desktop, and it's got a bigger pond Scorpio or in whatever file you had it in, and now you can edit it. Please let me know if for any reason you cannot edit it. Also, the comment portion where you can answer with comments. Please let your teacher know, and then we can work on doing something different, okay? All right.